The Cowboys used some trickery and benefited from three Viking fumbles to earn their trip to New Orleans. The first break came on the third play of the game when Robert Miller fumbled and Harvey Martin recovered for Dallas at the Vikings 39. One play later, Roger Staubach, who went 12 for 23 for 165 yards, threw a 32-yard touchdown pass to Golden Richards. The extra point was missed and Dallas led 6-0. In the second quarter, they went to their bag of tricks. On a fourth and seven from the Vikes 44, Danny White faked a punt and took off, picking up 15 yards and a first down at the Minnesota 29. Four plays later, Robert Newhouse went over from the five and a 13-0 Cowboy lead. Fred Cox, playing in his final game, got Minnesota on the board by kicking two three-pointers of 32 and 37 yards. But Dallas went into the locker room with a 16-6 halftime lead following Efren Herrera's 21-yard field goal. The Cowboy defense took over control of the ball game in the third quarter by continually keeping the Vikings on their own half of the 50. The Cowboys stopped themselves from putting the game out of reach, however, as Roger Staubach was intercepted and Tony Dorsett fumbled on the Vikings' 12-yard line. But following another Minnesota turnover, Dorsett redeemed himself on an 11-yard touchdown run in the fourth quarter that made the final 23-6 Dallas. So the Cowboys have a date with Denver January 15th in New Orleans, the site where Tom Landry's crew won their only NFL championship six years ago, 24-3 over the Miami Dolphins.